I think a deal would have not been possible with the former president Bolsonaro. Now he has gone and there's a new government, it will be easier, but nevertheless, the majority of the members of the European Parliament has made clear that they want binding and enforceable sustainability criteria, they want the deal not to contribute to deforestation and they want some guarantees. Indeed, the agricultural exports from the Mercosur countries will rise, and this will pose a threat to the agriculture in Europe that is already a lot under pressure, I think. Um, so I think a lot of these trade deals need to be analyzed sector by sector and what kind of benefits are there for which groups and then we need to balance these different interests. One of the effects of the war in Ukraine and the pandemic has been to make everybody much more sensitive uh, to the security of supply lines and the availability of materials of all kinds. If you can cement that relationship, make it more secure, uh, then that's a part of ensuring uh, the diversification, diversification and security of supply uh, for Europe. Uh, the same, by the way, would be true for, uh, uh, for Latin America.